my name is Dr. Gary Sykes. I'm an obstetrician here at the Sydney Adventist Hospital. A caesarean section is an uh, operative vaginal delivery, delivery uh, of the baby through a cut in the um, abdominal wall and the cut in the uterus. Um, it's done for various reasons. They've always been around and uh, in the past, the commonest reasons were for fetal distress in labour and uh, uh, what we call cephalopelvic disproportion or basically the baby getting stuck and being too big for the birth canal. And sometimes they're done antenatally for uh, similar reasons, so before the woman actually goes into labour. But now um, we're finding uh, a change. We're finding that uh, there's an increasing number of ladies um, who, uh, for instance, who would like to have a caesarean section by choice. I get asked sometimes at the very first antenatal visit, uh, can I have my baby by a caesarean section? So this is this woman's birth plan. Her birth plan is to have a caesarean section rather than a vaginal delivery. But as well, in the past, we did a lot more difficult vaginal deliveries and caesarean sections were more of a last rather than first result, resort. So these days we shy away from them and if it looks like it's going to be a, a more challenging vaginal delivery, uh, we would opt for a caesarean section instead because it's certainly a lot safer and less uh, potentially traumatic for both mother and baby. Well, they, in the past it would have been about 10%, but now uh, to about 30 to 40% of women uh, have caesarean sections for one reason or another. I get asked this quite commonly, what is the recovery like after a caesarean section versus a vaginal delivery? And to be honest, um, um, I think it's, uh, it's very good. Um, I'm a very fussy surgeon. I close all my layers very, very carefully. And typically girls have an excellent recovery and often go home on a bit of Panadol. Um, often they don't have to stay the uh, full length. They often go home early because they're happy to do so, they want to do so. But no, I think if you're careful as a surgeon, you, um, your recovery tends to be very, extremely good. So um, I don't think that's an issue. And certainly the recovery is better than what it would be with a more traumatic vaginal delivery with lots of stitches. Um, recoveries are very much an individual thing, um, but certainly um, for most girls, they're you know, able to go home and resume normal activities with limitations, you know, that you're not them doing a lot of heavy housework and uh, so on to straight away, but you know, the recovery is um, excellent, I find, as a, as, as a generalisation, but certainly all the majority of cases, yes, yes. It depends on what the indications were for the first caesarean section. So, for instance, if the indication was that uh, concern was the pelvis was not going to be adequate, well, that's uh, going to be a problem, obviously, next time round. Um, but if it was done for um, uh, other reasons, such as fetal distress in labour, um, then certainly that lady, if she wishes, um, can consider um, a vaginal delivery. Um, the main concerns uh, with a vaginal delivery after a zero section is the, uh, the uterus scar, the uterus rupturing, uh, particularly in labour. Um, and uh, in the past, we used to talk about a trial of scar, which I think is a more accurate description of the concern. These days we talk about VBAC, uh, uh, they want to consider a VBAC or vaginal birth after a caesarean section, uh, which is good, but it sort of um, doesn't really focus on what is the real concern. So the concern, and I think this is very important that the obstetrician points out to the patient the uh, risk of this, and that if a woman um, embarks on a vaginal delivery after a caesarean section, it may not work out for one reason or another. She still may end up with a caesarean section. Uh, because of concern about the baby in labour or lack of progress in labour and so on. And there are certain rules that we follow, uh, certain guidelines, because you don't want to put that scar under unnecessary um, uh, pressure. You know? So caesarean sections um, is certainly an option, um, and caesarean section by choice is certainly an option these days, whereas in the past that would never be considered. Mind you, into the past, caesarean sections were considered a lot more dangerous than what they are uh, today. And certainly today with um, uh, with the safety um, being as it is, um, certainly it's a very realistic option for ladies um, that uh, a woman can have a caesarean section if she so wants, but there always will be uh, a lot of ladies, indeed the majority, who have a caesarean section because there's good clinical indications why it's safer to have their baby uh, that way. Mm -hmm.